Let's talk about the proxy generator of Dime to Resolve version 18. If you installed version 18, then you should also have here in the start menu, type in proxy, you should have Blackmagic Proxy Generator. Click on that one and another program starts that one, let's minimize DaVinci, which is automatically asking you for a folder, select folder, and that folder is where you store your high resolution files. So these files have to be specified for Blackmagic Proxy Generator. So these MP4 files are stored at that location. Let me just copy that one minimize that one and into the watch folder which you can add with this button also if it's closed let's just exercise click on the add button the same window opens paste in the path for your high resolution video select folder select the quality which is the lowest one which creates half the resolution of 1080p files so that will be the low resolution proxy file okay and let's just open this folder where the high resolution are and after i click on start a proxy folder is automatically created there it is okay so the original files are mp4 and the proxy files will be mov there's the first one it just got generated so the program is converting the high resolution files at around 70 frames per second and i have to wait around 56 minutes and although my high resolution files are around 130 gigabyte my proxy files will require only around 5 gigabytes so the program is placing the proxy files next to the high resolution files in a proxy folder and the file names are exactly the same except the file extension now if you go back to DaVinci we can switch between the high resolution videos and the proxy videos by going here to playback proxy handling and disable proxies that will load the high resolution files and playback proxy handling prefer proxies that will load the lower resolution files now i'm not sure if exactly this one was converted but you should see a small difference between the high resolution and the low resolution proxy files you can also go to the media tab and right click on to these tab headers and check proxy okay and proxy currently says offline but you should see the low resolution mentioned here and resolution here's the original resolution currently all of them are offline and my proxies are offline because i also modified the path of my high resolution files if we right click on the header and go to proxy media path then that is showing a different path from it should get the low resolution files so click on the first clip right click on it reeling proxy media search the folder where your low resolution videos are that one open and the first video it's that one and open and now it's showing the resolution now let's do the same thing for the rest of them select that one go down select the last one right click reeling proxy media same folder and select folder finding matching media 83 could not be found yes because probably they are not yet ready no comprehensive cancel now some of them are ready and some of them are offline now you can go back to edit tab and at the first clip go to playback proxy handling prefer proxies and the quality should drop here and it is different playback proxy handling disable all proxies that will load the high resolution file and it looks a little bit different so put it back to prefer proxies and wait until this finishes by the way this program proxy generator is using here in task manager we can see that it's using the gpu the graphics card in my case it's an rtx 3060 now proxy generator completed the job everything finished and i rendered just a portion of the entire timeline with proxies disabled and with proxies preferred 
select it from here and the result is the same identical file size and identical quality 5.7k 5.7k resolution for both of them so on the left side with proxies and on the right side without proxies and the quality is identical so you can leave it at prefer proxies do your editing and your final delivered video will be of high quality so that's how to use blackmagic proxy generator after you've finished editing your videos you can delete this folder also that proxy currently i need it which is 6.3 gigabytes, not 5.5 as it was mentioned. 